everybody, it's Mike and John from PumaPlow.com uh, here with another Puma Plow Learning Time in Farming Simulator 15 on the PC. Aaron Bjornholm. So a while back we did a series on how to cow. On the Xbox, yeah. So we f thought we'd redo it with the PC version. But I'm going to show a little more some, you know, harvesting the wheat. Because there, there are some things that are slightly different. Yeah. And then, yeah, so John's going to harvest, this is field 35 on uh, Bjornholm. Yes, and I've failed. My in the God. So. You like the fast timing? Whew. Not really. I like it. Otherwise, this video would be like three hours long. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. I don't even remember how much of this I show, but I show a little bit anyway. So obviously, this is this video is going to be all about straw. Yep. That's what okay. this video is. So, clearly, the first step of straw is to harvest the wheat to get the straw. Planting. Well, planting But I didn't show that because that's, that's boring. Right. So. So, yeah, we're going to harvest, apparently. Definitely didn't show any of that. So, I just like the fast timing. With that, with the beacons and the hazards going, <laughs> the beacons are pretty awesome in fast time. I agree. All right. Mm -hmm. They almost like don't turn off. Yeah. It's yeah. It's like they go to half bright and then right back <laughs> to brightness. The, There's just it, not time, John. At least the blinkers turn off all the way. Yep. So. Well, you got a great demand down there in your mini map. Oh, it's it's dude, just like tweaking or something. It's on crack. Uh huh. Pretty much. So this is how you combine. It's amazing. I know, right? You've never seen it before. This is how you do it with an auger wagon. That's how I do it anyway. That's how you do it. I like auger wagons. Yep. So all the equipment you're going to see in these, uh, at least initial videos, will be in-game. Yep. All stock videos, or all stock equipment. Um, eventually, I think this, what, second to last one? Maybe the last one? It depends on how we do them. We'll yeah. see. We'll be modded stuff. We're going to showcase some mods that make cows way easier. Like a me station. Yeah. I think I'm going to miss that most from uh, the PC to console version. Uh, Yeah. So. It makes cows so much easier. Mixed yeah. rations and everything. So. Oh, yeah, it's great. Sure. Okay, am I done harvesting yet? I can't believe I lost all this footage in here. Seems like a little bit much. There we go. Okay, so the first thing you can do, obviously, is bale your straw. With a round baler. So this is the in-game little New Holland round baler. Yeah. Because you can use the bales for, obviously, the cows need bedding, right? Yep, definitely. So this will help do bedding. Yep. And then you can also you also need straw for mixed rations, which we will cover in a future video. So right, mixed rations are a whole separate video. Yeah. We'll get there. And I couldn't remember how to open the baler, so it took me a minute. Is that what that was? Yeah. So. And now here's the biggest problem with round bales. Yep. A, you had to stop all the time. Let's say you get about twelve feet with this thing. Is this the only round baler in the game? Yeah. Wow. B, they roll down the hill. <laughs> so I was kind of glad I did this on a hill just to show. See that it taking off over rolling, there. man. Exactly. So it's wow. like gone. And you have to stop all the time. Yeah. So you can use the little Ursa's pickup thingamajiggy. Now this thing's pretty cool. It's nice that they put this in at least. Because yeah. the last game didn't have it stock. Right. For a uh, console anyway. Right. Because, you know, that's where we played it. This makes uh, picking up round bales a whole lot easier. And then you can just take them and uh, you know, stack them here, I assume. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to unload okay. them here. Which is pretty cool. They stack up and then you can handle them with a front loader or something later. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. So, yeah. That's... Round bale handling. Pretty much, yeah. I think we continue with round bales right away. Oh, yeah? Into, yeah, how do we use them? Okay, so, yeah, there's actually a bale grabber, which is pretty cool. It actually works quite well yeah. once you uh, kind of get it. So, to put straw in for bedding, yep. you can use the um, the straw blower, which the bales bounce out of. Mm. So, this thing, basically, you put a bale of straw in. You're supposed to put it on the tailgate there. And, and then, right, and then you close the tailgate and it picks it up and chops it up, basically. Yeah, so there we go. It got it. Okay. So then it shreds it, and then you can dump it in for the cows. Yeah, it, although it's like it doesn't hold it down, so it kind of flip flops in there a little bit. That's pretty funny. So, but so that's giving bedding for the cows, which will help increase your productivity. I think it gives you ten percent or something. I think it is ten percent. Yeah. So that's how you do that. Okay. The or, other option. Yeah, you can put just round bales into the mixed wagon thingy. Which, if you're making mixed rations this way, you might as well have one piece of equipment instead of two. Yeah. So I really like the bale grabber, by the I, way. Dude, that makes brown bales so easy. I was actually having a lot of fun with it. Yeah, that's not bad. And you'll see here in a second. I actually overfilled it. I should have stopped you there. Drop them. But look at this. You can grab it like that. <laughs> yeah. Boom. Yeah, you're full, dude. Yeah, I know. I wasted <laughs> one bale. So I don't really care. That's okay. And then same thing. It dumps out. So this is actually going to dump. I decided to change sides. Oh. I thought it was funny, so I left it in. Okay. I decided to dump with the left side. It doesn't matter. You can do either side. Yep. But this is not going in the feed trough. This is going in as bedding. Right. So. Yeah, you can't feed the cow straw, even though it, look, it dumps right in there. It's yeah. not what it's for. But you can see the bedding increasing around. Yep. I didn't show the numbers. Probably should have, but I didn't. So. Okay. It happens. That'll be in the mixed ration video. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. 
we'll dive into the numbers there. That'll be a multiplayer one. That's fine. So, yeah. Okay, so that that's, just takes too much time. It yeah, it really does. All right. Okay, so, so we're back. To, this is the square baler now, yeah, right? This is the square baler. Kay. This is my preferred bailing method. Definitely. You have to wait till it's open. You have to wait till it's all the way unfolded. Shocker. Yeah. This is preferred because a no breaks. No breaks. You don't have to stop and b it rolls and c it's just it's just easier. It really is. So, yeah, it's a whole lot easier. Look at it, spitting bales out. Yep. But yeah, you so. can just roll and then you know obviously there's a pickup wagon for these two. You can pick them up manually with front loader, but uh, you know I didn't. I wouldn't want to. And uh, here we go. I I don't ever want to, but see how fast it spits them out, especially when the speed. But. Well, and the big thing is you don't have to stop. Yeah. So you can just keep your speed going. The whole and I time. didn't rake any of this. This is just what the combine outputted. That's yep. What we're bailing here. Yep. So as you can see, you make quick work of a field bailing it like this. Pretty much, yeah. And you know, I wanted one more. Or, no, I didn't. And the cool thing with this one is it has the bale ejector. Yep. So you can actually empty the baler when you. Although, if you notice, there's one in there because it's still a partial bale. Yeah, it's not a full bale. It's sixty-seven percent, it. so it can't right. eject. My cat scared me. Yeah, he scared me a little bit too. Okay, so here we go with the pickup wagon. Yep. Thing, thing my jig. It's like one of the best pieces of equipment on the game. This thing's pretty awesome, especially if you're gonna bail. Yep. Don't bail without it. I you 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 couldn't pay me to bail without this yeah. thing. This thing is is worth its weight in gold. So, it's pretty awesome. Yeah, I like it a lot. So same kind of thing as the round baler. I mean, it's same thing just for a different style of bale. Now, you'll notice something here in a second. Okay. Make sure you find a level place to put your bales. <laughs> really? Yeah. Did you lose them? Pretty sure. And actually, when it comes to the grass video, uh oh, yep. Um, That's I awesome. had a real nightmare Oops. with the grass Oopsie. video. So yeah. So now you're back to the front loader with just spikes. Yeah. So we're gonna try something here. Okay. Oh really? Can we put this in the straw blower? Will this work in the straw blower? Because it wouldn't actually work on 13 on the Xbox. Right. I tried. Yeah, me too. I got really frustrated with the straw blower because I thought it was broken. Yeah. But it's made for round bales. Yeah. So. But. Well, tease it. If you stand tease up on end, it, it would fall right in there. I couldn't get it to stand up on end, okay? So. But did you notice this is first try? Wow. There is, was it, there is was, it, though? There was no cuts, no editing there. Uh -huh. First try. Just saying. Uh-huh. It was. And then stand it up. But this is, the like, the really slow way to make straw. Yeah. Or to give them straw for, you know. So, now. That first off, really there's, dumb. there's not enough room here anywhere for, for anything. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, you got to watch it because it doesn't, like, stay in. Uh-huh. So, I thought I was going to lose it right there, and I would have been so mad. Yeah. So, you do the whole backup slam sure, on the brakes. Sure, slam it. Yeah, sure. So, uh, yeah, you can you can do square bales in there in the straw blower. I don't know why you would, but you nope. totally could. You can. Make Bessie happy. That's all that matters, right? Yeah. Now, you notice the theme in the tra with the tractors in this video? They're all blue. There's a couple of Ursas, but uh, okay, for the most part, they're all half tracks. Yeah. So. So, obviously, you can do the same thing. Oh, oh, oh. Well, look at that. Hey, bales. This is all I've messed with bales so far on the 15. Uh -huh. But it seems like they're a whole lot better than they were on 13. Well, it couldn't have been much worse, John. It, seriously. So. so, yeah. They're they're so, acting somewhat realistic. So, you're doing the same thing here, mm -hmm. just with the bigger one. Yeah. Just to show that you can do it and how much time it takes. That's why it's in real time. How much time this takes. It's ridiculous. And if you have a lot of cows, this is all you'll be doing. You're going to be doing this for six to eight months. Like that backup job, though? That was actually pretty good, yes. I know, right? So it's more bedding, obviously. And you just sit here and wait because it takes forever. So don't do it this way. There's a better way. There is a better way. Is there? You'll see it in a second, I swear. There it is. This is how you pick it. Well, you got to bale straw for mixed rations. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. But otherwise, pick it up loose with the pickup wagons here, the forage wagons. Oh, yeah. Which, this one shakes a little bit. It always has. It, dude, I don't know what it is with that. They need to fix that. No but uh, pick it up this way and dump it into the cows for bedding. Oh, it's so much faster. Yep, totally. You fire up your big tractor and go at 15 and then roll at 32 go over to the thing, you know? Jump your silage pile, whatever it takes. Uh, or get oh, stuck. Yeah, I got st Oh, yeah, yeah. One yep. or the other. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no, still didn't get it. Okay, hang on. Wow. Got to back up a little farther, you know. Any more of a run, right? Totally worked, right? No. Got it. Okay. 
So you're going to go around this time? So now I go around. Okay. That silage pit's in the worst spot ever. There needs to be just a dirt road around it, and I'd yep. be totally fine with it. So this is the best way to dump straw for the cows so check for, this for bedding. It's so much faster and easier. Yep. Now, like I say, you still have to bail for mixed rations, but we'll get to that later. Yes, you do. So there you go. That's, that's uh, how, you, how you straw for cows. There you go. So until next time, uh, we're Mike and John from PumaPlow.com. See you. Toodles.